like the eagle watching the direction of the wind and then it spreads its wings that's what we call soaring it does not fly the eagle soars amazing how children go to fathers daddy i want school fees i don't have what should i do that's irresponsible that is sin it's the same thing like drinking blood and eating flesh because you are destroying someone's destiny please don't get married when you are not ready to play your role being a man is not about having a masculine figure it's not six pack it's responsibility responsibility it's responsibility are we together that's why we finish koinonia i stand every friday for at least five hours when i stand here around 7 7 30 i don't leave this place sometimes till 12 or 1 in the night responsibility i return by 4 30 from a trip i've been away i've not even eaten anything truthfully speaking i'm here standing by 5 30 we are off again to lagos it's responsibility it's responsibility i owe a responsibility to teach you the truth under god you have honored me it will be wicked immediately i arrived i carried my laptop and my notebook first just to dust on the topics abba provider protector abba provider don't bring any woman into your life that you don't have it starts from relationship this irresponsibility has traces you can see it as a man don't keep quiet in a relationship every time there is a cost dimension even if you don't provide it be sympathetic to it are we together you want to pay school fees and your wife pays don't say oh well thank you no my wife thank you so much you have helped me do this i'm proud of you i truly appreciate me tell my wife this no way i won't do anything then you continue how many women leave their roles to house helps who win the hearts of their husband and they keep binding and casting because they are out gossiping with people who talking about people um um what's her name please make sure you know my husband doesn't like too much but just do this if you are busy it's justifiable but most of them is out of laziness and then the lady is preparing and the man is watching a virtuous lady she comes to serve him and the devil starts suggesting saying what was really your plan for a wife and at the end of it when those women come for counseling they won't tell you the whole story they will cut the part that makes the man evil are we together you must be willing to play your role you must be i can't come to a house and see children running up and down mucus on their nose their clothes with oil and the wife is just crossing her legs no ma you are failing in your role just because the man helped to dress the children is not his role the design of a woman is a reflection of her role visitors cannot come and sit down and then the wife is just sitting and then the man goes to the fridge he's trying to quickly prepare something i said well, find my husband that's how he is no that's not how he is that's how you made him god made him to occupy a position of honor is god speaking to us yes i must pray for you it's a responsibility i must attend to you as much as possible it's a responsibility i must sow into your life not waiting for you to carry money and come and give me no sir brother is that what you are doing in your relationship is that what you are doing in your marriage sister is that what you are doing let's correct these things tonight if you are not yet in a relationship thank god if you are not yet married thank god because now you are learning you are learning how many women are carrying the book you see a child sick children sick three children sick and you see the woman holding a hot air umbrella in the afternoon backing one and holding two with the umbrella just singing praise and worship and going and then the husband is somewhere and you will find that man in a pepper soup joint somewhere you see that or donating money to one man of god it doesn't matter even if it's me it's a sin 
take care of your family first don't carry any money and come and give any man of God and leave your family dying God does not act like that are we together and you are wondering where is this woman's husband child is coughing the other one is purging the baby is crying you see her tapping the baby standing in the hot sun and sometimes the husband can pass with a car and just wait later 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 no sir no sir no sir your father advised you that that's what he did to your mother to respect him but that's not the word of god we've been called out of every tribe and every tongue and every nation is god speaking to us don't expect to change if you are not taught it is the entrance of the word that gives light otherwise your default mindset even if you hated it is what you will see playing out i watch the way brothers treat ladies and i know they are on their way to being bad gentlemen now i know that ladies have their issues here and there but let me tell you it is still not enough reason please marriage is not by force it's not the condition for heaven if you must marry be willing to play a role it is true that the woman should respect you regardless of results but results is like a lubricant to honor and submission it is difficult for a woman to struggle to submit to a man who has proven himself to be worthy of honor he said let them that rule well be counted for double honor is God speaking to us? I'm going to stop here in that area. We are still going to talk on expectations very quickly. But listen, if you are in a relationship, or you are looking at a lady prayerfully, or you are looking at a guy prayerfully, it doesn't matter what category, or you are married, go back home tonight and ask yourself, if you want to get into business partnerships, what is your role? Do you understand? I'm coming into this business as what? Please, if you are a CEO here or you have a business, you are leading a business, go back and find out all the people involved in that business. What is their role? Let there be clarity. If there is one boy running around your house, one girl running around your house, let them know, are they protégés or are they sons and daughters, maybe spiritually or by reason of commitment? Don't leave vagueness in your house. Who enters your room and who doesn't? Who should enter your bedroom and who shouldn't? Who should open your wardrobe and who shouldn't? If you don't define it, one day something will happen that will surprise you. You see homes. There are times a man and his wife can sit down. They are discussing very private issues. And the next thing, their mother or mother-in-law, somebody just bangs the door. And then, oh, you for are discussing, bar. Sorry, uh, there's no, no. It's the fault of the man. Create a system of order. Anybody that comes under my roof should know their boundaries and their limitations. Are we together? Yes. Nobody should come to your house with your wife there and just enter your kitchen and start cooking. No, sir. If your wife authorizes her or on grounds of friendship, that's fine. People cannot veto into your life like that. A man who does not have control over his spirit is like a city without walls. Put walls. There are walls in heaven. There's no enemy there. Yet there are gates to regulate and bring order. Twelve gates. hallelujah i live a peaceful life as a man of god because there is clarity i don't have to come here in the daytime to check have they put the chairs no the people have been trained to keep their roles here and there people forget their roles or don't meet up to expectations then you can lovingly call people to order you don't blame everybody for one person's mistake when there is clarity of roles if there is no food in the house you know who to blame transfer of aggression is proof of lack of wisdom there has to be somebody if it is systemic you can pinpoint who should do this you don't blame your wife for something children should do children are running around there and you finish eating and your wife does not carry the plate and you have a young lady 13 years she catwalks and pass you there you call her back and say no pick that plate you are going to become someone's wife yeah, daddy I don't like this this is the kind of thing I, that's how I wash in that film tell her keep quiet keep quiet fast this is my house 
I love you. I've been responsible. I don't mean to abuse you, but it is not under my watch. If I train you and you get to the age of discretion and you mismanage your life, I can stand before God and men and say, that is my daughter. I train her. Her life is not a reflection of my convictions. You remain my daughter, but you, you reap the consequence of your actions. But not when you are under your watch. Don't let anything under your watch in business and in life go out without definition.